All right, well, Sniffles the dog has been touching hearts ever since his story went viral. By now, you've probably heard about this little pup who lost his nose after being attacked by larger dogs. Now, he was brought to Central Florida from Puerto Rico, and now he needs a new home. And we told you about Sniffles last week, and we were so touched. We had to meet him. <laughs> new Six at Nines, Carolina Cardona caught up with his story. A few days before Christmas, Sniffles was rescued by Poodle and Pooch Rescue of Florida. As you can see, he's a special needs dog because he doesn't have a nose. And he's currently looking for a loving home, so the family that adopts him will need to be patient and make sure to follow up with all of his medical needs. Despite the rough life Sniffles has had, his sweetness melts your heart. What makes him so special, um, I really like the way he looks at me. Sometimes he'll we'll perch up on the edge of my bed and just give me that look and he's like, okay, I want to snuggle now. He's uh, good with other dogs. He loves to snuggle. He wags his tail. Um, he gives Eskimo kisses with, you know, what would be a nose. Rebecca Lynch, president of Poodle and Pooch Rescue of Florida, says Sniffles was a stray dog in Puerto Rico where he was attacked by larger dogs. He suffered multiple injuries, but the uh, biggest, obviously, was the loss of his nose. He went through three surgeries in Puerto Rico. He miraculously survived, but was left with other injuries that require daily attention. Then he also has a hole in the roof of his mouth that's going to require flushing and cleaning two to three times a day. Back in March, an animal rescue group brought him to Florida where he was adopted. Rebecca says he repeatedly escaped that home until Orange County Animal Services picked him up and Poodle and Pooch Rescue took him in. Currently, he's cared for by Genesis Diaz, a veterinary technician at Chuliota Veterinary Hospital. But it's only temporary. It's going to be hard to let him go, for sure. I've just learned that he's a normal dog and to treat him with the same kind of uh, love and care as other dogs would get. Whoever does take him, he's going to need a lot of care. Lynch says the organization hopes <laughs> Sniffle's case will help other animals, too. The biggest need now um, is donations and uh, foster homes. So while Sniffles is unique in appearance, he's not unique in what we see and what we do every day. He shows why it's dangerous to be a stray and dispose of dogs. And we encourage people to go to their local shelters and adopt a dog in need. We want him to be the ambassador for rescue. Um, he's going to be okay. We've gotten so many applications for him. Poodle and Pooch Rescue of Florida tell me that they've received over 100 applications to adopt Sniffles. They are currently reviewing them to make sure that he goes to the right home. Carolina Cardona, News 6 at 9.